Hey there, I am Chris Palmer. In today's Google Business Profile video, what I want to share with you is two features within your Google Business Profile that will certainly lead to a higher conversion rate and less time on the phone answering questions. Now, before I get into these two easy to implement but powerful features inside your Google Business Profile, I'd like to share with you chrispalmermarketing.com where I can take care of everything. We have SEO services, consulting, even a mastermind if you just want to learn. So check out chrispalmermarketing.com. Now, with that out of the way, I want to go ahead and point out these two very powerful powerful features. The very first thing in order to find these features, you'd like if you're on desktop, which I am currently inside of Chrome, what you want to do is type in your business name and then do a search. When you do a business name search inside of the account that your Google business profile is in, you will be brought to a screen that looks identical to this, except for it will have your business name. Now, when you're on your Google business profile, you could see that there are a lot of options here. These options include edit profile, read reviews, messages, add photos, performance, everything is here. The two features that I want to point out can lead to higher conversions and less time on the phone answering questions. So the first thing I want to point out is see where it says messages. All right, click on the messages button. Now, when you're on your messages screen, what you want to do is click on the top right hand corner. There are three dots. Click on those three dots. When you click on the three dots up at the top right hand corner on desktop, also click the button that says chat settings. You're going to see four separate options, as you can see on my screen. There's turn on chat. If that's not on, I would turn that on because you can actually get text messages. Google will send you notifications on, I use iPhone. I just get quick messages that say, hey, you got a message from Google on your Google business profile. Go there and check it now. Next is send read receipts. So you can get messages back and forth. Next is the welcome message. So when people leave a message in your Google business profile and say you don't answer it right away, they will get a message just like this one where I send them directly over to my calendar uh, or you can send them into, you could send them anywhere you want. I send them to an appointment calendar to book consultation. All right. And then the last thing, the most important feature that I want to share with you that a lot of business owners miss is add your FAQs, frequently asked questions. So frequently asked questions will pop up when a person or a potential customer goes to ask a question. And what I mean by this is let's say we have a business. Let's just say it's this Chris Palmer marketing, right? When you scroll over here, let's say I'm a business owner on a PC and I'm looking for questions. See, ask a question. When I start to ask a question like uh, SEO services, right? Um, see how not only will reviews come up about past customers that I help, but also answers. All right. So answers will pop up in here. Like, do you offer SEO services, right? As you can see, do you offer Google My Business uh, or Google business profile management services. So it'll pull up answers based on the question. This can save time for you and your potential customers. So I just wanted to share with you what it would look like, but let's get back into the optimization. So again, we're on our profile. We click on messages. Then we go to the top three dots and click on chat settings. So this is the chat functionality. We go into the add facts and what we want to do is you want to add in frequently asked questions. This way it can help your customers get the answers without you actually being there, right? So within the messaging platform, and I'll also show you one other feature that's very similar to this that will certainly help your customers too. So what you want to do is click on add a question. So how about do you, do you building services? Uh, Chris Palmer marketing right? So this would be the response. You know, it can either pop up inside of the frequently asked questions like I just showed you before, or it can pop up if they type in, hey, do you offer link building services or link building service? It'll pop up inside of the messaging app as well without you having to type it without you having to be there. All right. So Chris Palmer Marketing offers a wide selection of link building services. All right, period. Test posts, citations, EDU links. Uh, we offer web 2.0, right? And the list goes on and on, right? Like press releases. I'm actually filling this out as well too, right? So we offer all kinds of links and this would be a canned or a canned response that if they asked that question, it would say, hey, yeah, we offer link building and we offer all this type of link building. Want to learn more? Head on over to the website, right? So now another powerful feature that you might've known about uh, but I want to point out too, is going to be the questions and answers. This is facts. 
Okay. The other one I want to share with you is the Q and A. All right. So the first is messages, AKA the FAQs as well. And now there's questions and answers. So what areas of the United, like these are frequently asked questions that again, if they start typing in the questions box, you'll see them on the right hand side, along with reviews, like I showed you before. So what you can do is click on add a question and yes, you can do this from within your profile. Don't be spammy with it. You know what I mean? Like make sure you're actually trying to help the customer. That's the only point of this, but it, but it does give a certain level of optimization to the profile, because if all you're talking about is your services and the locations that you provide them in, not only is it helpful for the end user, your customer customers or potential customers, it's also going to help optimize your profile, but don't abuse this. All right. So what you, what we can do is, you know, uh, do you offer, I'm just going to do the same question. So facts. And then in the questions, do you offer link building services, right? So, and then you can see automated. So this was questions that popped up. So this is, there's many things. So post that. All right. So that's done. Now, what I can do is now that I asked that question to myself, I can go in there and answer it to help my, the other customers, right? So are you taking new clients for SEO, right? So I'll answer this one. Yes. We offer services at uh, services.chrispalmer, M-A-R-K-E-T-I-N-G.com forward slash sign up, right? So they can head right on over to HTTPS colon services.chrispalmermarketing.com forward slash sign up, right? So then we could post that as an answer, okay? Or I could go back to the other question that I just posted and I could literally add a question, then answer it. This will save time for anybody that's answering your phones, right? This will save time for any receptionist, for yourself. If they already have a lot of the answers to the questions they have. It'll be a lot easier for you to close the sale. Plus it's just helpful for the end user. Like that's what it's all about. You want to service your potential customers. You want to make your life easy. You want to make their life easy. And with that being said, my name is Chris Palmer. If you have any future questions related to Google business profiles, Google my business, local SEO, or just SEO. SEO in general or any of my services, feel free. Go ahead and ask any question in the section below. I answer them all and I look forward to seeing you in the next Google business profile optimization tips video. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much and have a great day. Bye-bye.